Amazing Grace is another person's fast food toy story. Yay! Yay! What's up guys? My name is Percy and I'm the Guinness World Record holder for the largest, if not the largest, collection of fast food toys in the whole world. <laughs> and I'm the Guinness World Record holder for the largest collection of fast food toys. Yeah baby! And I'm here once again to tell you another amazing and stupendous and awe-inspiring Percy's Fast Food Toy Story. So once again, we have for our fast food toy story for today another exciting toy because it's from the movie Frozen 2. Okay, as you can see, this is an unusual box because this was actually flown in from Hawaii, USA. So thank you, Jeff Consulta and the wife. Uh, who really took uh, the effort to actually complete the set of Frozen 2 toys from McDonald's Happy Meal. So we have all of here singing so happily that he was actually uh, able to make it in my collection. <laughs> These are actually the first Frozen toys that were actually added to my collection. So thank you so much. It's been a long time since Disney and uh, McDonald's collaborated and I'm glad that they seem to have uh, reunited once again to bring us some amazing toys from Disney <laughs> in our McDonald's Happy Meal. Okay, so here's the side, some cutouts that you can use as a design as you make some uh, art plays or role playing with your characters from Frozen 2. That we have <coughs> the Happy Meal smile with some autumn leaves. Uh, floating up in the air to usher in the cold winter months. Here in the Philippines, it's already December, but we don't experience any winter. Actually, all uh, the season we have here is just summer and rainy. <laughs> the, the summer season and the rainy season. Okay, so here, but it's a little bit chilly at night. Although it doesn't have, we don't have any snow, but it's cold, uh, which is uh, quite. Uh, a breath of fresh air because it's a welcome treat especially if you're living in a tropical country to be able to experience some cold nights and experience a little bit of a cold Christmas is a welcome treat indeed <laughs> okay now let's get on with the toy Ta-da! who could this be since uh, the, the, the plastic is transparent, we can see from here that it's actually Sven, the reindeer. Is this a reindeer? I think he is. Okay, let's open up the... This is a German language. Ah, uh, German. I think Sven is a very German. Probably from Scandinavia. <laughs> anyway, <clears throat> so... This is toy number four, Disney Frozen 2, and we have Sven. So open up Sven. Oops. I don't think I really cut it all. Okay, so once again, the toy comes with this uh, message. So parents and children can enter a chance to win in the games when you go into. Uh, sign up in McDo app or at Mac magic at mcdo.com scan and enter code <clears throat> to see if you are a winner <laughs> you simply have to scan this and then be able to find out if you're actually a winner of some amazing products from Frozen 2 movies and McDo okay let's go uh, yeah enter that game and then, uh, once again, the toy also comes with this key that you have to insert in the main figure. Okay, so here is Ben with some protective plastic here so as not to break the antlers. Okay, look at that. Isn't this great? All oh, the details. This is quite funny. Yeah. <clears throat> kind of sounds like Eddie Murphy. <laughs> this moves, this Ben. Very fun, very funny tandem of um, Van Nicholas. Well, later on, we'll get to know the master of Sven. 
who happens to be the boyfriend of Anna. <laughs> okay, so this is great. Look at that. Some yeah, the details are very excellent. And look at the face. I don't know if you can see it. It's actually uh, very much just uh, very much like the character as we would see him in the movie with a very 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 funny surprise look from Savan. Okay, probably wondering why his master is proposing this so and so, <laughs> and then he seems to be a very much uh, of a uh, yeah of a genius for a ranger <laughs> that he is actually able to sort of suggest some more ingenious suggestions for his master. Well, anyway, so this is Ben, and then just like the other toy, it also has this hole at the back and from this hole we insert this key here so that's it and then we find a surface and if you could find a snow patch <laughs> yeah if you have snow or winter wonderland kind of uh, thing going on in your country you could probably slide them there so she is actually he is actually sitting on this snow mound okay so what happens is we push the side of the key in order to actually speed up the slide of Ben. okay so once again let us try to push the ring this key oh wonderful <laughs> did you see that it's so fast with a blink of an eye oh, all of a sudden that is uh, nowhere out of sight he's out of sight okay so once again let us see spin so we push the side of the key oh my goodness or probably what you can do is you put the other characters there and then once you push um, uh, so then you can actually topple down some of the characters and you can actually make a game out of this and if you're able to topple down as many characters as you possibly can uh, that uh, player will obviously be the winner of the game isn't that a very creative way of actually playing with your Frozen 2 characters aside from just you know displaying them or making some uh, vignettes or scenarios, you can actually make a play a uh, game out of this. And considering that it has a very forceful impact, you can actually uh, do that. You know, toppling down other characters. Oh my goodness, so great! Oh wow, Sven. Other than the fact that you have this very, very a very big horn. Uh, this is quite a dangerous animal to be sliding around. Just like that. Anyway, I would say this event toy is just an amazing grace. So once again guys, let's try to be thankful for every amazing grace that comes to our lives beating the form of this event toy, just like I said, or also be thankful to our uh, pets who are actually faithful friends. If you have a dog, if you have a cat, you have a hamster, or you have a parrot, <laughs> those are wonderful lovely companions. Or probably if you're living in Scandinavia or in some very cold places, you could probably have a uh, reindeer for a pet. Okay, so these are very beautiful pets who would add, uh, uh, add a lot of color and adventure into our life. So we have to be thankful for them. Or basically be thankful for every amazing grace, uh, be they small or big, be they seemingly insignificant, or the truly eventful ones, or just about every amazing grace that make our lives a lot more happy and jolly. <laughs> so, thank you guys for tuning in to Persons Fast with Toys, and I hope to see you again with our next one. So, until then, pa pa ra pa pa, love kuto. Bye bye, see you around.